Here we have two Tesla valves on our pulse jet. One of them's shown, this one's shown open right here. And this one is closed. So basically this is just a heat exchanger that heats up our propane before it goes into this point here. Now, the, the spark plug is right here. The combustion chamber is right here. And this barrel right here just adds a little bit of vacuum. Um, as everything's burned and accelerated out the front, there's a very low pressure inside of the chamber. But when the explosion happens, it doesn't allow the air to exit and come out the Tesla valve. So regular pulse jets have physical valves and that limits their frequency or the amount of pulses per second that this pulse jet can get can be thousands per second. We've got a Venturi effect happening right inside of here that causes vacuum. When the high speed air comes in, it pulls vacuum on these valves here and that automatically starts drawing in extra air after ignition for the combustion chamber. And it also helps compress the gas as well before it ignites, which is where you get most of your power from. In the future, we'll replace the barrel with a dual stage metal Tesla turbine. Now for some cool explosions that happened while testing. <laughs> 